Good morning, happy Monday. Today is June 15th, 2020. Um, eventful weekend, but feeling good. I'm tired, um, but happy, drinking my coffee, and headed up to a forestry evaluation. Um, Shepard and I have 15 plots to do today, so it's gonna take all day. It's a little overcast, so I gotta make sure to wear extra sunscreen. Um, this is the weather that I get burnt in the most. I got burnt this weekend and it was sunny. We had so much fun though. Saturday was really eventful. This weekend, I feel like every weekend with Esmeralda is super eventful. Friday night, we had date night. She took me out to a fancy restaurant. It was really cute. She was trying so hard. It was so cute. Um, we had dinner at 7.30 and then ended up going out on the town after that and just kind of enjoyed the night. Went home. I skipped home. I was a little, maybe had one too many drinks, but it was really, really enjoyable. Saturday, I let her sleep in a little bit. Um, I went, well, once she got up, we went to the farmer's market, um, walked around, chit-chatted, kind of saw what was there, got a few vegetables. And then she's like, oh, you know, I've been doing really well. I've been saving my money. I really want a bike since mine got stolen. I said, go get it, go get it. So she went and got a bike, and while she was doing that, I was helping protest a little bit. Um, they have, like, I guess it's considered protesting, but I guess every Saturday, the American Health Legion, I believe is who it is, in Chico, um, they've done it for the last 60 years where they, every Saturday from 1, or from 12.30 to 1.30, they, they protest, they bring signs, and they're out on the corner um, off, off one of the main streets in Chico. So I held a Black Lives Matter sign while she went and got her bike. So I was out there for about 45 minutes. It felt really good to be able to participate in that because I get so much anxiety around um, being around large crowds. And so that one was a lot smaller, so it was a lot easier for me. And I'm learning how to like push myself outside of my comfort zone in aspects that I normally wouldn't be willing to. Um, she got a new bike. She's super excited about it. We went back to the house, hung out for a while, and then ended up going and getting lunch at Burgers and Brews. We had a few drinks, and and I had a steak salad and some french fries, and she had a cheeseburger. It was just low-key. It was really enjoyable to just be. Um, again, I probably had one too many drinks, and I was exhausted. I had a long week prior to that. Um, so I think I was like passed out by 8, 8.30 and she watched a movie. I went to sleep. I didn't sleep very well. I haven't been sleeping very well the last week. Um, yesterday, I got up. I went for an eight mile run and then she came, she met me a third of the way and we got coffee um, and then decided to go get a burrito and head to the river. So it was our first time really hanging out at the river down there. We recommend going to a different site than where we went on the, um, on the is it the Sacramento River. It was really pretty out there. There's just too many people at the location we were at and her and I both kind of like it a little bit more secluded. So that was enjoyable and then we came back. I got summer. My legs got summer. It's weird for me to say that I like to wear shorts now but I like to wear shorts. So my legs got a little summer. It took a bath. Had some fruit from the fruit man. That dude is amazing. I love his fruit on the corner of park in 13th I believe um, yeah I had a good night cleaned up the house a little bit and then I was tired uh, practiced my Spanish and then I uh, made lunch we went to bed and here I am so today this week I think is gonna be pretty eventful we're not completely sure how it's gonna go but I'm I'm hopeful for it for it all to work out um, uh, this upcoming weekend was the weekend that, that Esmeralda is supposed to go back to San Jose, but she pushed it out a week because she wants to wait until the end of June, and I don't blame her. Um, I applied for a couple jobs in San Jose that I'm actually kind of hopeful for. One of them is, I think I've talked about it in the past, it is um, the biology job, and I'm really excited. I'm kind of hoping that I get that one just for the experience, and I actually think that that job will be really enjoyable. With the same company, I also applied for the position that I'm currently in as an engineering technician. Um, I'm not sure if how it's gonna go, but I feel like experience-wise, I'm way more better with that one. 
So that's my update from last week. My upcoming schedule um, is forestry and irrigation evaluations. Or not evaluations, sorry, um, irrigation design reviews. It's just keeping me busy and staying hopeful and hopefully getting a better night's sleep tonight. We'll see. Um, I'm working through a lot of mental stuff. I had quite a bit of anxiety last night, which is weird because I've gone really smooth and not had any anxiety for quite some time. And then it kind of hit picked up last night. Um, I had an awful nightmare, but I was able to kind of just write it out afterwards and be. So that's it. I will check up with you later. I'm headed to some forestry evaluations and happy Monday.